Guten Tag, mein Name ist Dr. Friedrich von Zimmerheimer von Schweinwist von Gutenheimer an der BMW Volkswagen und Hitler Auschwitz Wiener Schnitzel of the CDC, also known as the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention in the United States of America. Now, on behalf of the CDC, we'd like to inform you of how to survive a zombie apocalypse. Kyle here, our resident Jew, I mean homosexual, I mean gypsy, I mean black, I mean cripple, I mean Catholic, I mean test subject, will be showing us how to survive the zombie attack. Now, to prepare for a zombie attack, you need to stock up on some supplies like water, food, medications, tools, sanitation products, clothing, important documents, and first aid supplies. Although if you get beaten by a zombie, you're a goner anyways. One more thing, the CDC does not approve of violence. Yeah, check out these guns. I'm ready to kick some zombie ass. Wait, what? Where did my guns go? It is also a very good idea to plan emergency procedures with your families. Start by identifying the type of emergency, which in this case is a zombie apocalypse. If you are unsure, contact your local concentration camp. I mean police station. Oh my god, honey. What's that? Quick, check the CDC website. Hold on, babe. I just need to connect to the internet on my iPhone. Pick a place for your family to regroup in case you need to evacuate your house due to a zombie invasion. A good place to regroup could be your neighbor's house. Oh my god, it's a zombie! Everybody run! Make sure you can identify your emergency contacts. Always have the number of the zombie response team or police station at hand. Ugh, I should have gotten a Windows phone. Plan your evacuation route. When zombies are hungry, they won't stop until they get food like your brains. Which means you need to get out of town. And fast. Wait, you dropped your wallet. Oh sweet, a platinum card. But don't worry, have no fear because the CDC is always here to help you. We can assist you in areas such as consultation. Okay, bad news, you're infected. So, I'm just going to leave this pistol on the table and I'm just going to walk out of the room and I'm going to walk back in in about five seconds and when I come back you better have given the cleanup crew something to do lab testing and analysis patient management okay I need you to turn your head and cough <coughs> all right now turn the other way and cough <coughs> good that's nice <laughs> that tickles Tracking of contacts. Hey, have you seen my? They're dead. What I'm looking for. They're dead. But you didn't even. They're dead. But I. They're dead. But. They're dead. And infection control, including isolation 
and quarantine. Freeze, this is the CDC Zombie Task Force. Everybody stand back. Okay, it's safe everyone. The zombie is contained. There's no way it could break free. Once again, on behalf of the CDC, we hope you are now prepared for any kind of emergency. Especially zombie apocalypse. This is Dr. Friedrich von Z Zimmerheimer von Schweinwist von Gutenheimer oder BMW Volkswagen und Hitler Auschwitz Wiener Schnitzel. I mean, auf Wiedersehen. Okay, I think I'm connected now. Thank you for calling the automated police hotline. Due to new labor laws, we are unable to answer your call at the moment. However, I may still be able to assist you. If you have a medical emergency, please press 1. If you want to report a robbery, please press 2. For more options, press 3. Please hold and enjoy the music while I connect you to the appropriate automated hotline. God damn it. Mr. Samuel, bring me a dream, make her the cutest that I've ever seen, give her the word that I'm not a rover, and tell her that her lots of nights are over. Samuel, I'm so alone, don't have nobody to call my own. Please turn on your magic beam.